Hello everyone and welcome back to Mage Mondays and I have the puppy here obviously only for his biscuit drawer. Um, if you didn't see or you weren't in on stream last Friday, just so you know, I did play a bit of Elden Ring and we got Radan in one go, people. So that is the main thing that happened in stream. If you want to go and watch it, it is on my YouTube channel. Catch up there, then come back to this because this is post stream. Um, I need to return to the castle and speak to Jeren that is on the list to do now. So we're going to do that. So hopefully you have caught up. It's very quick. I get him, I munch him very, very quickly, thankfully. Uh, very pleased and kind of shocked about that. But hey, uh, let's go and speak to Jeren. Confirm that we have conquered, conquered Radan. See here. This lady is still here. I think there's a point where you can use her or get her as an ash for summoning. I don't know if that's correct. I'm sure I read that somewhere. She would be pretty cool just as a healer. It's quite a nice way of doing it, I guess. You're the sort of offensive person then you've got a healer just checking checking up on you and keeping an eye on your health right let's talk to the man At last the war festival has ended brave champion you have our gratitude the celebration was spectacular general radan is surely pleased i hope so festering with rot and crippled by madness all he wanted was an honorable death Finally, my work is done. It must be so boring just waiting for someone to kill him. I have a task in mind. Old business. You could Old business, eh? You may we meet again if the fate Cool. It's time I may we meet again. Okay. So that's done. Let's have a look at my little checklist. Talk to Jeren. Now we need to find the note at Mistwood Ruins. Free Blythe from Fallen Hound Everjail. Talk to Iggy at the spot free Alexander at the cliffs above Jarburg. Collect the finger slayer blade in the crater at the end of the path of the south of the forest. Purpose of this guy, do not talk to Rani yet, as it will give her the blade. Talk to Dee's brother in the crater at the path of North Nocron. North of the forest and kill gargoyles. Really? Is that where we're at? Underground crater slash Leonia lakes. So, Mistwood ruins. So that is obviously here where we have unlocked Nocron after killing Radan. Okay. Look at that crater. So I'm assuming it means that by the note. Um, from what I remember originally, there was never really a note to, to guide you, but then the developers put it in just to help tell people specifically where they needed to go. I'm sure the note is around here. Yeah, look. Find the note. There's a traitor taken care of. Onwards to Nocron. Then go on, I'll catch up. So it says to read the note and then three free by from Fallen Hound Everjail. I thought that was later on, but we can go and check, seeing as it's not really far, is it? Uh, I think it's this one. So let's go here and check that out. Check out what's happening. Unless he gets caught there twice, I was sure that he was put there later on by Iggy, but I may be wrong. It's very likely I could be wrong. He is here. What? I've not done that before. Who put him there so early? It's me, Bai. Old EG is trapped me here. Told me I'd bring him off, but failed to lose Rani. But there's no chance that could happen. I'm part of a bee. 
So he, Iggy, already saw what was happening before. Wow. Open it up. Are you going to give me anything for that? <laughs> My thanks, friend. I'm going to see Mistress Rani now. But even if the odds are slim, I need to check that Mistress is safe now. Rani can finally set in motion the fight against her fate she's dreamt of for so long. Well, I would not have ever known about that. I know that he goes there because Iggy locks him in, but I honestly thought that was later, unless I'm going to see Mistress Rani now. he uh, figured it out before and tried to capture him twice. And now we need to go to Iggy and have a word. See what he says. We'll tick that off. And then we're going to go and free Alexander again, um, where he's got stuck in the same spot again. Funny. Ah, you've defeated Jell. The general was blighted by scarlet rot and driven to madness. But not long ago, he was mm. hailed as the mightiest demigod of them all. Not surprising. There is no parallel to your achievement, nor to Lady Rani's acute judgment of character. Thanks to you, Lady Rani's fate was mm -hmm. underground. Where the fallen star struck Limgrave and make it yours. I presume you've spoken with Bly. Yep. Yeah. Kind well. of freedom, mate. There is something you should know. The two fingers gave Blythe to Lady Rani as a faithful follower. Her very shadow. Incapable of treachery. But if Lady Rani, as an Imperian, resists being an instrument of the two fingers. The shadow will go mad. Oh. Transforming from a follower into yeah. a horrid curse. Bittersweet, that. that. Is his destiny. In such matters, Blythe's own thoughts hold no weight. It pains me so. But he must be neutralized. For Lady Rani's sake. What a shame, eh? What a shame. Don't think I need to buy anything from you. Don't think I can. I need a five. I can start leveling this up. But at the moment, I don't need to worry about that. Right, so now we go and free Alexander again. And he was a Jarberg way, wasn't he? Do, 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 do. Jarberg is somewhere here. Yeah, yes. So let's go to the artist shack because I think it's above Jarberg. Oh dear me. Well, I say. That's so sad, but it is Dark Souls. Or Souls, sorry. Souls, Elden Ring. It's all quite sad and tragic. I'm sure he's around. Oh, it says above the cliffs of Jarberg. So. We'll have a look, see. Uh, yeah, we're, we're sort of going the right way. Where be you, sir? Oh, just as I asked. Help me. Here you are. I'm stuck. Hello. Hello. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, as you can, sir. Man, would you mind helping? My thanks. A thousand thanks. I'm mm, sorry, man. Just give me a good and I'll pop. Mm, don't worry about my wound. I'm stuck back together, good and proper. Just give it your all. <laughs> my lower half is stuck on something down there. Uh huh. Now, I can feel my lower. I don't think you can get me out just by hitting me this time. Hmm. Let's think. Slad. What if I could slippery sliding slidey slide? Uh I'm not sure I can craft or even know how to craft. I need to find the oil. Hmm. The oily boys, right? Let me just have a look and I'll be back in a minute with a crafted pot ready to help Alexander. Okay, so we have the pots crafted. Let's just 
are attached to. Let's see if we can do this now for him. Shit. Might need to craft a couple more. That'll do. You are a man of this will have me I uh, have a good feeling about it. right. Come on. Hey, triumph! Woohoo! You're oily and nasty, but hey, we'll get back to it. My thing. As a token of my thanks, I'd like you to have this. Hmm. Oh, hear you me. I'm oilier than a toad. <laughs> Yeah, there were countless oil jars back where I'm from, actually. And now I know what it's like to be one of them. <laughs> <laughs> where are you off yes, to now, then? Indeed. I, too, have oh, a home. Yes. Just Though below. it is one to which I have vowed not to return. Oh, sad. So, I thought I might look at oh. the top of the cliff. But as I drew closer and closer, pow, wouldn't you know it? I was perfectly stuck in that. It must be such room. an annoyance to get stuck in holes, eh? Warriors inside admonishing me for my mawkishness. To walk the path of champions, one cannot cleave to the past. I'm headed to the fiery mount in the north. I can strengthen myself there without fear of. Oh, yes, I guess it's when we next meet him, Fire Giant. Is that what he's saying? Anyway. That is done. Tick! So next we have doo -doo 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 -doo. collect the finger slayer blade in the crater at the end of the path south of the forest. For purposes of this guide, do not talk to Rani yet, as it this will give her the blade. Right, so the finger slayer blade. So we need to go to Nokron then. And that's also where we will meet Dee's brother. So we need to go back. Hither. Yes. Let's do it. Let's go to Nokron. Excellent. We did um, unlock Altus Plateau as well via the lift, the Dectus Medallion um, in the stream, last stream. If you're interested in watching me stream, I am currently streaming Friday evenings and Sundays as a committed stream time. Um, Friday, so I have been playing Fallout, but I'm thinking maybe changing it up a bit. The, the problem I have, or the conundrum I'm in, because Elden Ring DLC is imminently coming to us, less than a month, I want to dedicate a lot of time on streaming for Elden Ring, the DLC, um, which is obviously why I'm doing a mage run at the moment as well. So I have different characters at different levels. Um, so to basically fill up the time before that is released, I'm sort of just in and out of games on Fridays in particular. Sundays is Demon Souls, so that is a pretty good continuing uh, stream on Sundays, obviously. Um, Elden Ring, I'll be streaming all the time that I can get for that. So if you have any suggestions of things that you want to see, check. I can do sort of one-off episodes of games that people are interested in. I'm kind of looking at some survival ones as well because they're not so big open world style games. I don't want to get into a, another game just before Elden Ring, essentially, like Ghost of Tsushima or anything like that, which I do intend to play and stream as well. So I'm totally open for suggestions. But Wednesdays too, this is sort of the same thing. I do a video for Wednesdays. Um, at the moment, it's been Hades 2, which has been fantastic, and I will continue playing that. Um, but again, it may be superseded by Elden Ring, DLC because I want to try and play as much as possible. So in the meantime, I may just carry on with Hades 2. People seem to like that. It's a very enjoyable game. It's not as intense as, you know, open world RPG games. So, and not another Souls game because I also have Souls Saturday, which will continue um, currently on DS3. 
So if you want to watch any of that, please check out my page, my channel. I do update on the community page as well. Give the video a like, show your support. All that gubbins would be greatly <gasps> appreciated. And thank you everyone for being here and everyone for coming into stream as well. It's been absolutely fantastic. It's a very new thing for me. So I've really appreciated taking the, the jump and it being a positive jump, you know? So thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's my piece. Let's try and get through here without dying, preferably. That would be fantastic. I do not particularly like this area. So if I can just get through without killing myself by dying to gravity and by these things, that would be fantastic. Uh, let's go here. Lovely. I need a somber five. People. People, people. Somber five. Okay. Let's just get this quickly. Oh, stressful. Shot me in the foot. I'm just gonna reset. Um, I have got Lusat's staff. Ooh, flasks. Yes, yes, excellent. I have got uh, Lusat's staff equipped. Can't yet wield it, but I did get tipped in the stream that having it just equipped helps buff the attack power. Um, I should, I guess we can just check that, that out, really. Because I don't know if I'm doing it right. I will admit that. Because I haven't done... I never, ever do mage runs, just so you know. It's not a thing, so it's all new. Oh, that's helpful that he's using his shield. So, for science, I can't tell because he's using his freaking shield. Oh. And obviously, I can't. My God, boy. Stop what you're doing. Oops. Oops, I didn't mean to throw that. <laughs> I meant to drink. Right. I can't get a true damage on him because of his freaking shield. Stop. Stop now. This is annoying. You annoyed me. Right. Let's try someone without a freaking shield so I can... Thanks for that. Ooh. Right. 510. I mean, I don't know. I will say that, I just don't know. 462. So maybe it does work. I don't know. I can't tell. Shit. I know, I'm just letting him do his thing, but... I mean, I have no idea. Right, what else have we got around here? Some stuff here.
I'm not sure it does, but I don't know. I, I might be wielding it incorrectly, you know? Right. Something in here. Let me just get that. Thank you. Oh, nice. Another larval tear. Fantastic. Uh, just want to get this stuff and then book it. No. Excuse me. No, no, no. We're not doing that either, girl. We're just collecting shit. Fuck, 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 fuck. Exactly what I didn't want to happen. Look at that mob. Unreal. <sighs> right. Now we can just book it on free. I don't even care. I'm still uh, sort of contemplating whether to put back the uh, little... Uh, physic, bubble physic, you know, rather than, uh, I can't remember what I had on at the moment for my physic, and it'll be FP buffs, I'm sure. Two and a half, not even two and a half K, not worth it. But we'll go down. Ah, Mimik? Mimik. Obviously, there is a real good cheese to this. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck off, you prick. Why are you even here? This is not your domain. Piss off. Guys are stressful, dude. Right. Okay, sorted myself out. I need to use this because I have the um, golden bow equipped to that so I can buff myself and then it's just in my sort of off hand so I can quickly ac access it. I did swap the staffs around so the loose hat stuff is there. Um, I think it's still equipped, but I'm not 100% sure on that. Um, obviously, you can cheese the Mimic tier by basically being naked and then putting all your stuff on. Let's just try the Mimic normally and see how we fare. We do have uh, Lutor in case I need him, but I want to try and just see what happens. One on one. Probably is absolutely going to munch me, but that's fine. Oh, using a uh, little star shard still. Okay. Oh, healing up, lovely. Just what we want. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Until he kills me and then I don't love it. But I think we got it. I think we are a better mage than the Mimic. He was too busy doing all the things, you know? Well played. Well played, my man. Well played. I'm not doing I'm not doing it on purpose, but hey, it's fine. 
You do you. Cool. Um, question of Mimic. I think Mimic would be quite good with um, using Mimic for sorceries as me, as a mage. I have the other playthrough which I did on the channel. Please go and look. The full playthrough of the Elden Ring is on my YouTube channel on the playlist. I did not use the Mimic tier for that. I ended up using... I got... Um, I got the assassin in the end. Uh, I can't remember her name, but she was probably one of the best um, Ash summons that you can get, other than if you go down the route of getting Dung Eater. Dung Eater. But I didn't go down that route. That's also a route that I'm interested in doing, and it may be on this playthrough that we attempt to do that. But I think it's quite finickety. I'm not 100% sure on how you do it, so... If anyone's got any pointers, please let me know for that. I'm sure it's something to do with the... Ah, yes! Somber 5, excellent. Um, it's something to do with Celibus's poison that you feed Dong Eater when you see him in the prison and then he becomes a puppet, something like that. And it ends up being your, like, Ash summon. Um, still also trying to remember the Assassin Lady that you get sort of in the Evergel with Rani, uh, past Rani's quest. She's very difficult, but she is highly, highly leveled when you uh, use her. She is absolutely just amazing. Um, and she has all of the like assassin moves, the quick moves, so it's really, really handy. Uh, trying to remember her freaking name. It will come to me. It will come to me. It will come to me. So, we are here now. The next challenge is to get the Finger Slayer Blade and the Mimic Tear so we can start using the Mimic Tear, which will be fantastic. Lots of fun with that. Really interested in some of the boss fights that I, I struggle with generally when I'm sort of more of a melee build, a big bonk build. Astor comes to mind. Very frustrating boss for me usually think that we could probably deal with him fairly well. Um, the other one, which we did last night, first time, people, first time, was Radan, who also I struggle with. Um, I thought I would struggle with him with mage runs, but no. Nope. Didn't happen. Um, we do ha also have to find Dee's brother, who I think is further up at somewhere. The other good boss, I think around here, maybe, no, it's in Sofria, so Sofria well, is the dragon there, because you can get a good sorcerer. I think maybe I need to get that, actually, because it's more of a magic seal and he you get a good weapon the halberd which is one of the best weapons i think in the game uh if you use the special um special move on the weapons that one is amazing because it just buffs the weapon and absolutely chunks away enemies and you don't really need much to um use it you know so it's a great weapon the dragon halberd i think it's called possibly oh so yeah that may be something that we need to look at or i go and get if i stream oh shit again or off stream because it's not a main main thing i'm just gonna collect all of this that i can I'm not too confident on the old uh, oh, ha, 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 ha. horsey horse and pillars. Not the best. So let's just get off the horse a minute.
Excellent, excellent. Right. Let's get this lady. We could try some of these as well, like the Mimic was using. That's obviously a mist near you as a person. Oh, trying to grab me, are you? Trying to slap me around. I see, I see your game. Nice, that's quite a quick spell, I like that. Hmm. Happy days. Got nothing to say now, have you? <laughs> right. Let's pick this up. This is actually really good as well for us. Uses FP, but it does like, you know what they have. The ancestral spirit has it too, it kind of um, in front of you casts some, yeah, a spray spirit vapor. Very good. And for Mimic, if you have anything equipped here, I'm sure everybody knows, if he, she will use whatever you have equipped. So if you've got the healing stones, they're really, really handy to equip. I don't, oh, these warming stones. Even if you equip one, because she would just, I mean, mine's a he, he will just drop them so you can go in those areas. This will be good as well. Produces a magic bolt. This, I said, will be good. He can use them. And the star light shards as well. Mimic will use all of them and they are sort of, they don't, you know, they don't run out. They are just there for him to use. I am I will only have three or one or whatever, but Mimic will just use them over and over again um, indefinitely. So it's better for me to just have them attack, like, um, equipped and he can just use them all the time. Right, let's go back. Let's just go. Uh, I need to find the correct... Uh, grace so that I can find um, the next part of Nocron. Need to get that blade, not give it to, it said not to give it to Rani, or not to speak to Rani and give it to her at that point. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, Mimic here. let's do that. Status, as much as I can just level up my mind and my um, intelligence <laughs> lacking. Mm, two? We still have Ladan's soul. Oh, that's quite sad. Um, power. Power. Uh, as this is a mage run, I, I don't really think it's worth popping the soul, so I may just unlock the weapons and get whatever because... At some point I can use his profile again, do something different, and then I'll have all the weapons still. I'm not even sure that's enough. Oh, just perfect. Perfect. So let's do another one in intelligence. I'd like to get this up as much as possible. I mean, not to have to rely on the helm that I'm wearing. So I can wear different things. But at the moment, you need so much intelligence to, wear, to use anything of worth like um, higher up in the game, in the levels, that it's just literally grinding away and getting getting those levels. That was harder than it should have been. We still have these ancestral spirits as well. I haven't got the first one either in Sofria Well, so that could be something fun to do. Obviously, we're streaming and stuff as well. We've got all of that gubbins that we can do all of these good things. Light these as we go. Oh, excuse you. Right, we need to go around to the left, I think. Should be a red fox radigan. Past that is the grace that we want. Here you go. Lovely. All right. So, let me just sit. I think the next objective is to get across here. 
Um, and then we can get hopefully the mimic here and the blade that we require to pursue Rani's quest. Uh, wrong way. Lovely. I really hate the parkour, honestly. Stresses me out. Nice. Um, right. Oi! Fuck off. Not interested. <laughs> no. No, no, no. Uh, down. Stop following me. Piss off. God damn you. <sighs> right. Black wet blade. Nice. Oh, I don't need you. Here we go, I think. Is this where Mimic Tear is, possibly? Please tell me I've got bloody sword stones. Because that would have been annoying. Oh! And that be that! Please, please, please. Yes! Tick! Excellent. One and done. Now it's just for the blade. And then we can finish up having some fun, upgrading hopefully the mimic tier, getting that all ready. Good stuff. Got one of these horrendous balls here, which I do not like. Oh, but I am a mage. Can I get him from up here? First time I can do this. Bane of my life, these usually are. But hey, look at this. This is what I'm talking about. This is why you people mage, eh? Yeah, you come at me, bro. Yeah, that's right. You go there. Excellent for me. Easiest thing ever. Love it. Ah! Fine. Stop now, you punchy bitch. On the edge, eh? Yeah, you do that with your knife. Let me just... My mask. You cheeky bitch. Oops. <laughs> Sorry. Doing that shiz with a knife. What the frick? Right. Now that I've decided to not beat up my microphone, let's carry on. You give me a larval till. Yes. Yes. So, how the frick do you get up there then? Must be through the top somewhere. Oh, I see you hiding. Yeah, yeah. Your mate did the same shiz. One more, one more. Yeah. I like it. Thanking you. Full flasks, lovely. Okay. Let's go out here. Grace, we like that. So usually I just um, will summon for this just because there's quite a few enemies that come up at once and it deters their attention from me, which is good. I'm just going to reset. So I've got my FP back. So let's bring out Lootal. 
Let's do the shiz, because I think one of them becomes like a troll. Celestial dew, always handy. Soft cotton. Ah! Oh, you cheeky bastard. Yeah, he turns into a troll. So we're just gonna go up here a sec. Um, excuse you. Whoa. She hits hard. Covering his face for. Just lay down right by me, so it's really convenient for me to damage you. That would be great. You're cooked, mate. Nice. Lovely. And you guys are still here. Fun times. God, they hit hard though when they actually throw shiz at you. She's got a big weapon, I guess. That'd be why. Big long weapon. What's that? Like a great sword of some sort? Is that it? Oh no, she's there. You're about cooked, mate. <laughs> Excellent. Right, so we have that quick uh, travel point there, but I think this is where the blade is. Oh, nice. Great glove wart. We like that. Is there anything else around his item there? Or is that just the... No, it's just the shadow. I don't think there's anything around here, is there? No. Vuto is just following me. Cool. So this is not the most thorough of playthroughs. I'm just trying to get as much done before the Elden Ring DLC and... I'm kind of avoiding trying to be so highly leveled for it because I want to see what it will be like in the DLC. I know it's going to be hard. We're going to be humbled. We're going to be high on a death counter. But I do have a full leveled um, playthrough as well. So it's just kind of like a bit of fun, you know, testing out um, how effective different styles of playthroughs are, levels, I intend to play a lot of the DLC, different style gaming, um, different leveled gaming, like I said, different weapons. Also depends on what they have in regards to weapons and incantations. I'm not a pro player, so it's going to be a challenge, but I cannot wait. So if I'm not being so thorough with this, that is, you know, sort of the reason why. So now we need to find, I think, Dee's brother. Which um, is somewhere. I need to look for a jellyfish. Here we go. This looks promising, doesn't it? I think there's also, up here, some items. I'm definitely coming off my horse. <laughs> There's an item up here. Can't quite remember what it was, but it's a good one. A mottled necklace plus one. Excellent. That looks interesting. Can't quite remember what it does, but it's handy to have. As many different talismans as you can get. Now, there is this bit here. 
Lovely. Let me go down. Might as well sit. And now it wants me to go to D. Talk to D's brother in the crater at the end of the path north of the forest and kill gargoyles for ease of grace. Now, I did already do the whole killing D. D is dead. So usually you can summon him for the gargoyles, the twin gargoyles, unfortunately. I'm not sure I can now because I killed him. So it may be worth me just going back to the round table and sorting out Mimic Tear in case, because I think I'm going to need Mimic Tear. Um, let me sort that out and I'll be there in a minute. Right, so I have leveled up Mimic Tear as much as I can. I think I needed a six glove wart. So she is more leveled up than what Lutal was. So that's good. I'm also just leveled up a little bit. I haven't used the Sombre Five yet. I want to try Trina's sword. I know it's sleep. Damage is a little bit more. We're just trying it out. Want to try some new things. Uh, I didn't use the level, the Sombre 5 yet because I'm not 100% sure what I want to go with and I only have one Sombre 5 which is taking me forever. So um, we'll leave that for the time being and see how Trina's sword does. I love that I can just munch these guys from up here. This is fantastic. You ain't going nowhere. You cannot get me. Ah, ah, ah. Hmm. What's that gonna do? You can't fly. Not far anyway. Throw some of these glint sewing stars on you. So quite quick. Nice. And they stagger him, which is good. Because I can pull off these quite quickly. Did it? Did it? We'll just chip away at you. It's fine. Da da da. Da da da. Oh, <laughs> that's satisfying. Crucible Horn Shield. I don't think I ever bothered trying to get that guy, you know? Because why would you, on a bridge, horrendous bridge, they're so difficult. Ooh. Lovely. I think there's another pillar as well over here. I'm going to be able to get that. Not far enough. I mean, to, yeah, it's not going far enough. Okay. That's a shame. But it's on the other side. So we have... These might be a bit more tricky. Because... I can't dodge them from far. He's going to come at me, isn't he? You know? You know what I'm saying? Helpful. Oh, I should have not picked this fight. <gasps> I shouldn't have picked this fight. Oh, I'm sorry. He's like, you can't even get me, dude. Ah. 
Okay, now. Yee! I'm stuck! I'm stuck! I'm stuck! I'm stuck! I was stuck. What can I do with that? Literally sandwiched me. Impressive. We're going to book it past him. <laughs> we are not doing that. Okay. <sighs> uh, this way. It's a shame you can't get him from up here. It really is. Where's the other dude at? Oh, don't tell me he actually does not come back. Really? No way. I've never done that fight before, so that's interesting. We'll try and avoid that guy. I don't want to get stuck there again. It was a pain in the bam. Wait. I think there's some things to pick up somewhere. He has got an item here. Yep. Cool. Bye. <laughs> no, no, no. No. I can get down here. <sighs> this is more important, dude. That was lucky. Ooh, order healing. Please die quietly. Oh my God, don't tell me you're still coming at me. Please, go back. Hi. Good, good. You made the right choice. You made the right choice, man. Just, just go back. You can't be asked. You can't be bothered, right? You're tired. You're wearing a lot of heavy armor. You got some spinneroo thing spear that is the bane of your life. You don't want to have to deal with me. I'm not really causing any problems. I'm just, you know, doing my thing. I'm not going to bother you. You will not see me again. You know? Why? Why bother? Let's put some light on in here. These candles are not quite cutting it. Right, nothing else here. Fudge sake. Why don't you fuck off as well, you know? And you. Both of you can do one. Uh nice. Over here? No. Oh. Well, that's disappointing. So there's matey boy. I'm just checking that no one's coming at me. Doesn't look like it, does it? Good. Right. Oh, 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 okay. Oh dear. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. <laughs> and then this monstrosity. Um... Oh, you can still summon him? Well, I don't know if you like summoning in, but as part of the storyline, the NPCs, which I am following along here, um, I'm going to summon him, you know, in honor of the Golden Order and all the twins and stuff. You know, um, I'm not making excuses, but he's pretty cool as well. Uh, what I'll do is I will not summon in Mimic Tear just yet. We'll see how we fare. I know these are rock boys and they are a pain in the ass. The main objective really is to try and kill the first one 
before the second one comes in, but I mean, it's a big ask. Oh, 282, nice. I just need to stay away and not and not uh, get rotted, so avoid the rot and things as well. But with D there, sort of helping, keeping his, you know, attention, he's already, um, fucking hell, staggered, right. And then comes the second one. It's so difficult. I'm not a fan of this fight. You know? Staggered again. I don't know where the other one's at. He's there, okay. I don't know whether I'm just being lucky dodging him or what. Yeah, I was being lucky dodging him. Okay, cool. He's done, he's done, he's cooked. He's cooked, he's done. People, we have one guy left. Let's do it. So I think Mimic Tear and me would have been fine, but it's nice to have D in on the fight. Nice, and he staggered him. Look at that shiz. Yes. I don't know if I can put these guys to sleep. Who knows? I don't know how I'm dodging all of this. I'm not really dodging it very well. Woo! But D's pretty good for health still at the moment. I feel fairly confident. Oh, I say that. That just happened. But he staggered again. We've got him. We've done it. How? How has that happened? First time again, people. First time again. Radan and the twin gargoyles. I mean, wow. Thank you, D. You survived it too. Amazing. Amazing. Mage. Maging. Maging made this easy. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh, let's just check my lists. I think that's a really good finisher. Uh, right, and then get the, the grace for ease of teleporting later. So we are not teleporting now, but we can come back here. We have finished this area for the time being. Um, I tried the sleep thing, but we obviously, I don't think it works on them, or you need to do it a few times. It will be good for the god skin duo, I think. 31,000 runes sorry not souls so that is going one off in there uh, do we have enough to pop to get some more maybe in mind where is my mind oh yeah almost could do another couldn't we we got to build up that intelligence, people. 2,000. Oh, that's a sad, sad state of affairs. 10,000. It was something like 20 odd. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Oh, I'm so pleased. That usually is one of my least favorite fights. So it's a whole new experience as i said before it's a whole new experience doing it as a mage run i'm still learning there's a lot of you that have come in on stream and given me some really great advice and tips which i'm eternally grateful i will say this i never use a shield unless i can put it on my back and it buffs me somehow um the jellyfish shield is probably the closest thing that i would consider using but for mage and for my normal runs i never use them um but you know, uh, I think the staff is, is doing well. I'm excited to use some of the other um, staffs and level them up and the other spells. We are getting there. So let's see what our status is at the minute. So we are 39 intelligence. That's with the helm on, which I think is like plus five. I do want to try and find the other scar suit or sword seal. 
that buffs things like the FP and your intelligence rather than the dex and uh, stamina and health. I think that will be more appropriate for the build that we are using at the moment. But yes, please give us a like if you're enjoying the video. If you want to see more, come in on streams Friday and Sundays at the moment, possibly more, definitely more with Elden Ring. I do have Mage Mondays and I do have videos on Wednesdays and Souls Saturday. So continually giving you as much content as I physically can. So your help, your advice, your support, you coming in on streams has been absolutely fantastic. I've loved every second of it. It's made my days. Thank you so, so much, everyone, for all of that. As I said, if you're enjoying it, please give us a like. Help the channel grow. That's what we're here for. We're here for gaming and growth. Thank you so much. Take care. And until next time, ta-ta. I'm going to give you a small one. Okay, and then he'll disappear. There you go. Good boy. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> cool. Right, sorry.